Hey you guys, it's Kim and we are at Kroger this morning real real early and it has rained all day yesterday but they have some new weekly digital deals today. I won't be shopping for any of those but they do have some excellent deals. Um, I know the Lubriderm Lotion for $3.97. There's a $2 digital coupon in your app. You can pick it up for only $1.00. 97 also the five time digital event is still going on it's the same deals as last week so i wanted to try to create some new deals maybe that you could pick up that i didn't pick up last week if you want to see some of the digital deals that i did last week you can go back on last thursday and watch my video and it will show you all the deals, same deals that are happening for this week. But I will be using my Abata app today if you're not signed up. This is my code and you're welcome to sign up. You will automatically get $10 in your account as soon as you scan your first receipt. But I am focusing mainly on my Fetch app today. So if you hadn't signed up, be sure and sign up for Fetch. You will get 2,000 points, which is equal to $2. Um, I will also get that as well, which is a big thank you to you if you do that. But this is an awesome app. They give you extra bonuses. And I'm going to be able to pick up a free ice cream cake today. And I'm also going to be able to pick up um, some more sweet treats because they're giving me extra bonuses, like 50% off. So I'm excited to be able to show you how you can use the Fetch app and grab all these great deals this week at Kroger. But both of these apps are linked in the description box below. All you gotta do is click on that and it'll take you right to where you need to sign up to get started. So I do hope y'all sign up. I love, these are my two favorite apps that I love to use. But let's go in Kroger and let's grab some great deals this week. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna pick up is I'm looking for the Good Humor Vignette Vanilla Frozen Ice Cream Dessert Cake. That is a mouthful. <laughs> but it's 22 ounces. And they are $5.49. Now, these prices, there it is on the end, kind of. You can see it. But there is a fetch reward offer for 100% cash back. So, that little cake is going to be absolutely free. So, check your fetch offer and see if you have that because they are going to give you your full amount, $5.49 back. Okay, next, I'm gonna pick up the Klondike cones. They are $6.99 each. And I'm gonna use my $2 off one and $4 off two printable coupon. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pick up three of these because there is an awesome deal on Fetch. They are offering 50% back on the shakes or the cones. You could pick up the shakes, but my coupons were just for the cones. So, and it does say which ones are included. And you can redeem this up to five times. So, I'm going to take advantage of at least three times today because I have those two coupons. So, check and see if you have those coupons or I think coupons.com has got some on there as well that you could use if you um, couldn't find, you know, these exact ones. But Fetch will be given $3.50 back on each one of these. So my final cost for all three of these will be $4.47. Now, if you just maybe wanted to use the $2 coupon and pick up one box, you could buy one and pay $4.99, then submit to Fetch for 
and 50 cents cash back and then your final cost to be a dollar 49 so i think that's a great stock up price since um, spring is here and summer's coming so you want to stock your freezer with some nice frozen treats next the frutella it is on sale two for four dollars now there is a Kroger cashback offer and it's 75 cents off one and then also Ibotta has a rebate for 75 cents off one so your final cost will only be 50 cents so if you're looking for a great um, I bought a rebate and working on any bonuses this is a great thing to pick up also if you're not sure how to use Kroger cashback in the description box below there is a whole playlist on how to shop at Kroger and use all Kroger cashback and weekly deals and sales deals everything is all in that one playlist and it will tell you step by step on what to do the choco love bars now my closeout one they're definitely gone but i'm going to pick up one of these the almonds and sea salt these are so good for 2.99 there's a croaker cashback offer for 80 cents cashback and and an ibotter offer for 80 cents cashback so your final cost to be a dollar 39 great item to pick up if you're working on your ibotta bonuses next the m ms they're 10 for 10 these little tubes they're on sale they're back in the easter department so look for those um there is an ibotta rebate for 50 cents back on each one plus there is a uh, coupons.com has a 50 cent off too or you can have a printable coupon whichever one you would like to use then i bought a has a 50 cent cash back on each one of those so that's going to bring your total down to only 25 cents each so you, if you need some little Easter basket goodies for your kiddos or whoever you like to fix baskets for, then this is a great item to pick up this week. Okay, next on the Spend 40, get $10 back in instantly at the register. I was going to <laughs> do this deal, but my store was completely wiped out on some of the things that I wanted to pick up. But if your store is in stock, then I would pick up one of the Viva paper towels that are $16.99. Then the Airwick oil warmers for $2.75. Then I would grab two of the Airwick refills for $9.99 each. Then I wanted to pick up one of the Lysol toilet bowl cleaners for $2.29. All these items would total you $42.01. Okay, there's also so many other items that you can choose from that's in this event. There is lots of great coupons in the April PNG that you would be able to match up with this when you get your April PNG coming in the Sunday newspaper so but if you want to do this now this is an, just a little scenario that I put together that might help you you know grab a few items right now with the coupons we do have for um, today also when working the spend you know amount deals at Kroger you do have to make sure that after all digital coupons you have to make sure that your total is forty dollars or more that's why mine is 42 because i'm going to use the dollar off one lysol digital coupon after that coupon comes off then my household ten dollars will come off and that will leave me a total of $31.01. Because you have to meet that threshold of 
Now, if you're using printable coupons or coupons.com, whatever apps you're using, you can, that will be deducted after the $10 comes off, which I like to try to make sure that I can use coupons, you know, after the total. That way, you know, you get a bigger discount. But you could also use the $6.50 off to Airwick printable coupon or there's a buy one get one free in the 3 6 smart source that will take up up to 650 as well. But that's going to bring your total all the way down to 2451. That's what you would pay at the store, but then you could submit to coupons.com for $1.99 on the oil warmer. Then I'll use the dollar off one Viva coupon on coupons.com. That'll bring my cost down to $21.52, which is an excellent deal on um, picking up all these household items. A lot of these are on sale anyway, so you're getting even a bigger discount. So it's, um, you know, 50% off or more of the retail price, which is great. Um, but there's all kinds of items you can, you know, choose from. Just think of that. But I'm so bummed that my store was not carrying the things that I need. So I'm gonna, not going to do this deal today. But anyway, I hope you can grab some um, awesome household items if you need those to stock up on. This is a great, great opportunity to grab those while you can save that extra $10 and a little more on some with your, you know, using your coupons. Okay, so this is all I'm going to pick up today. I think this is more of a, a spring sweet treat haul. So let's go check out and then we'll go home and go over the receipt and see how everything turned out. Enter your alternate ID or touch thank you. Your total is items. Okay, guys, I am back home from Kroger with my little teeny haul. I am bummed they did not have, you know, the things that I needed for my spend 40 get 10. But I hope y'all can grab that deal. I'm hoping maybe I could put it together another scenario for um, Sunday after the coupons come out. If I do, I will post a little video on YouTube or put it on my Instagram page. But these are the things that I picked up, and everything went fine. Now, I did use the printable coupon from coupons.com on the M&Ms, and it did uh, beep, but the cashier did come over and just manually enter that. But, um, you know, if it had enough and your cashier won't do that, you can always use the coupons.com app to submit your receipt to, to get your money back. But anyway, um, everything else went through. Um, the other, the Klondike coupons, they scan just fine. But let me show you my receipt real quick. If I can get it to focus. Oh my goodness. It is not gonna focus. Okay, there's my Klondike ice cream. Three of those. Then there's my ice cream cake, chocolate bar, the fruit gummies, and then the uh, two M&Ms. And then here's where my $2 Klondike coupon came off, my $4 Klondike coupon came off, and then there's the 50 cents that she had to manually enter on the M&Ms. And before tax, it was $26. And I did get back from the printing machine and a coupon for the challenge butter, which I'm going to go in there and get one of those because those are on um, the weekly digital deal for $277. So that'll be a great deal on that. So look out for those Catalinas. I did earn some more points on my power up rewards. I didn't use any coupons on that this week, but I will 
um, definitely do that next week for sure. So make sure you're still collecting your points and rewards to enter to get your free coupons. Okay, so everything here is a total of $37, and that's retail after the sales. Now, after coupons, it came down to $26 after I scanned all my coupons. I got back $1.55 from Kroger Cashback and $2.58 from Ibotta. I did have a bonus, but it was $3 off $15. And I'm just not going to grab a bunch of things that I don't need. So sometimes, if you're working on your bonus, sometimes we just can't finish them. But I'm hoping to maybe get a good weekend warrior bonus and maybe get a Walmart haul um, up on that. But we'll just have to wait and see. Um, but Fetch, oh my goodness. Fetch, the app on Fetch, um, first of all, I had to submit um, my receipt on this cake. I had to re-like correct my receipt on that. And I think it's because that's the way it's listed in the receipt, GDHMR. And sometimes that happens and you have to, you know, correct your receipt because they're not sure. They it doesn't say like good humor on there, so they can't catch that. And also, I had to re, you know, correct my receipt on the Klondike cones because it picked up as those little, those little bars or whatever, the little square ice cream bars. So I had to correct my receipt on that. But I did get back five dollars and eighty cents, counting um, the bars that hooked onto that from Fetch on the cake, and then I got back. $10.50 for the Klondike cone. So those worked out just great. Just make sure when you scan that it does pop up. If not, you need to make sure you correct your receipt. But that brings this whole haul to only costing $4 out of pocket. So I'm just going to call this my sweet treat haul this week. So please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. Hit that bell notification so you won't miss out on any videos. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.